I'm going to show you how to transfer your character to a new server in New World. You can screw this up, so be careful if you're skipping around through the video to not miss anything important. There's going to be a few limitations when you're transferring your character. You can't transfer into a full world. You can't transfer across regions, so you can't go from like an EU server to an NA West server. And you're not going to be able to transfer into a world that you already have a character in. When you do transfer, you are going to be able to keep your level, your titles. You're going to keep everything in your store storage and your inventory you're going to have your house and you're also going to keep all of your quest progression so you're not going to lose much but there is a few things that you are going to have to manage before you make this server transfer before you go through and do any of this stuff you want to make sure that you actually have a token to do this just go into the end game store Go to the bottom left where it says world transfer and click on that. And then once you do that, you can see your coin right in the middle of the screen. Before you actually go through with the transfer, you are going to have to do a couple of things. The first one is going to be that you're going to have to leave your company. To do this, all you have to do is go to the company tab at the top of your screen, go down to the bottom left and hit leave company. Alongside of not being able to keep your company, you're not going to be able to keep your friends list because your friends list is tied to your server. Okay, so a big mistake that people make is that if you are server transferring, it's usually oriented around your friends and they're usually already in a faction. If the faction that you're trying to be in on the new server is the controlling faction, which means that they own the most area on the map, then you're not going to be able to actually transfer into that faction once you're on the server. If this is the case for you, make sure that you just switch factions before you transfer, and then once you transfer, you're gonna be in that faction when you get to the new server. I've heard a lot of people making this mistake, so make sure that you don't screw this up. Next up, you're gonna need to make sure that you don't have anything for sale in the trading post. To do this, all you have to do is go to the trading post, click my orders at the top of the screen, make sure you are in the active orders tab. And then if you see anything that you have for sale, just click on that item and then click yes. And that will bring the item back into your inventory. Finally, you are gonna have to make sure that you're in a sanctuary or an outpost when you're making the transfer. Once you make sure that you do all of these things, go ahead and go back to the store, go back to where you purchased your coin, hit purchase, pick the server that you do wanna transfer to. If the server you're trying to transfer to is under maintenance, then you're not gonna be able to transfer to it right away. You're gonna to have to wait for it to come back up, but pick the server, click select world in the bottom right, and then click confirm transfer and you will be transferred to the new server. If you wanna make a lot of money once you're on the new server, be sure to click the video right here. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you found this helpful. Thanks for watching.